Hey guys, this is a supplement review again, and this one is for Jack's Micro. Gotta get all close, because they made the container twice as small. It's still made by USP Labs, of course, and probably... They've, they've taken some things out of this one. Yeah, compared with the original, they've taken out... The creatine? They've taken out creatine out of it. They took out... There's no more beta alanine. And there's no more of the 1,3-dimethylalanine that is supposedly, like, really bad for you, and it's banned. But they've uh, changed the formula, like we said. Uh, what did it have in it? Yeah, now it doesn't have, like, beta-alanine or creatine in it, but it has uh, the... It's getting pretty popular. I've been seeing it around. It's the L-citrulline. And I think that's probably what they use as the replacement ingredient to what they had before. That's what I think. Because everything else is pretty much the same. It still has caffeine. Um, the original Jack had 5.5 uh, grams of. And in one serving, it had one point. It had 5.5 grams in one scoop. This one has 3. Point this is 3.65. So this one, it's actually a smaller dosage, and it it actually isn't that bad that it's actually a smaller dosage, because when we took we took this, we still got a strong pump. We got we had some strength gain. And it didn't. We we did get focused too. So it's we feel that it was kind of like a a subconscious like focus. Like you didn't know you were on a pre workout. Yeah, it didn't but feel. You still got a, a really good lift in. It kind of felt like one of those days. It makes you feel like you have one of those days where you just have an amazing lift day. You're all psyched out. You, you're all you're all psyched out before you even hit the gym, and you didn't even take anything. That's what this feels like. That's what it felt like when we took it. And there, and we also it felt like. It's less focused than the original Jack, like the whole, like, it feels like you have tunnel vision through the back of your eyes, but it actually works well it's having a, less. It's enough. It's enough. It's, it's enough. enough focus. To, it's enough to get you through your workout, and that's kind of what matters, too, so smaller dosage, which we didn't feel made the biggest difference in the world, and, you know, the container's smaller. The container's the, way smaller. The container, yeah, the container's smaller than a concrete, creatine. This is the smallest pre-workout container there probably is. And right now, yeah, they only do have one uh, one flavor right now. Yeah, fruit punch. Yeah. And, it, oh, it actually does taste better than the original Jack also. A lot good. better, yeah. Real good. But they only have one flavor out right now. So if you're, you're waiting for the other flavors, you just got to be patient. Be patient and go on USP Labs, see what they have to say. Call them. Email them. Um, at supplement shops and vitamin shops, it's kind of pricey. It's probably around... Um, Maybe fifty dollars, maybe a little less, like forty-five. But um, I bought this online off of uh, Bodybuilding. It was actually a really good deal, uh, thirty-two dollars. So not that bad. Um, yeah, I don't. I have never even seen it yet because I haven't been to a, a supplement store in a while. So I don't know how much it actually costs in stores. You could uh, you could look that up easily. But yeah, it's not we, that. Yeah, it's not a bad price. We highly recommend this uh, pre-workout. Yeah, it's actually really good. It it, ha it did everything it was supposed to. Gave you a good workout. A good, solid wor uh, pre-workout. Yeah. So if you want to get bigger, faster, stronger, we actually do probably recommend you take this if you need a pre-workout. Got it. Yeah. Peace.